What's up, y'all? So, anyway, I know a lot of you don't want to basically splurge out $50 for, um, the, that was so unprofessional, I'm so sorry, for the fair and white, um, skin perfecting lotion, but I think that is a great lotion. I've seen that it really works. I, I mean, pairing it up with the glycolic acid soap, and you don't even need to pair it up with glycolic acid soap. But basically just using it with the glycolic acid soap and koji, koji sans koji acid soap, which is all you need, which is, um, the only thing you need to use it, this is just koji sans, because I've seen like, like a lot of my subscribers told me, uh, when they use koji sans koji acid soap along with, um, fair and white, not so white, but the exclusive whitener, which is another great lotion from fair and white that they noticed that the two work fast together. Now, the product does contain hydroquinone, and I wanted to give a discussion about what hydroquinone is. I don't think that anyone should be afraid of hydroquinone. It's not going to damage your skin. Um, hydroquinone will damage your skin if you abuse it, okay? But I'm going to make another video and upload it tomorrow, or maybe the day after tomorrow, explaining basically how hydroquinone should be used okay so anyway what i really wanted to talk about was because i said that you know not so many people want to splurge fifty dollars or sixty dollars on a lotion i did find this find um the fan way so white online for about thirty five dollars thirty six dollars i believe on amazon but um two of the most affordable lotions that you can get for about like eight to ten dollars is um g and g's um, Dynamic Clear lotion. A lot of people say that this lotion contains steroids in there, but the thing is, is that most dermatologists prescribe products with, with steroids in there, and it's up to you. I mean, they would give you some, some advice or some tips on how to use products with steroids. The thing with products with steroids is that you don't, you, you can't continue to use products like, um, it's, but any product like, like a skin whitening product, you shouldn't overuse. You shouldn't use it more than two months if you don't notice any results coming from the product. So that means if, if you don't notice that the product is helping to lighten up your skin, especially if it's a product that contains hydroquinone, you just continue the product after two months. And the thing with products with, um, stories is that they work a lot more faster. I know because I used this last year and basically how I use this is I applied it every night. Okay. So I, you know, what I did at first is just Gave my bottle a good shake, okay? And I use this as a mask. Just like if you would've used something else as a mask, I use this as a mask. And I just apply it very gently to my skin and I allow for it to basically not, I, I, I didn't massage, I didn't massage it all the way into my skin. I just allow for it to dry. And what that actually did was help my skin to exfoliate. So I wasn't using this every other day. Um, every other day to the point where my skin could get damaged from using it. Because as I was going to say, the thing with, pro with products that contain steroids is that they work, they work very fast. But you don't want to use them for over more than, more than a month. Um, a month is what I'll basically give a product that contains steroids. Don't use it more than a month. That's the trick with using products with steroids. Do not use it for longer than a month because if you use it for like two months to three months, uh, it's going to work in a month. Trust me, it's going to help to get your skin lighten up and exfoliate with, exfoliate it within that month. Um, and just to let you know the GNG contains glycolic acid. Um, it also contains um, lactic acid and a few other uh, alpha hydroxy acids that are in here as well. But because it contains a steroid, you don't want to use it. So give me one second and I'll be right back. Is a, a safer alternative to the red lo lotion from GNG, and that is the one that comes in the peach bottle. Okay, I heard that this one doesn't include steroids in here. I'm not a skincare professional, and as I told you in my video before the last one I released, which is early, I believe, um, you know, my videos are uh, automatically uploaded. Um, you, I mean, the thing is, is that, uh, I really need to give like a video where I'm like really teaching how you can use these products. It may not work for everybody as I said because one product works for someone does not mean that it's going to work for you. But the, I mean this is basically just the G&G. This, this, this doesn't contain steroids in it. 
um, like the right one. You know, the peach one is one that if you go and do some research in the most skincare um, forums, you will see like a lot of people saying that the orange one is better. And the peach colored one is better. And I still don't recommend that you use this for any longer than a month. You should not use any skin whitening product. And that's the why you, you see me, I'm always constantly switching between my products because you're not supposed to use skin whitening products for too long. You have to rotate around like use this product and then you switch after you know three months um use another product and you can come back back around like rotate it ro rotate it rotate it rotate it around so anyway these are just two lotions that are very inexpensive hcc7 is another great lotion that i've seen that really really highly moisturized my skin it also kept my skin really moisturizing this summer. I have not noticed any any damage from using these lotions and that's because I played the safe. I didn't use them for too long. Um, you don't want to use them for too long. The thing with uh, products, especially with hydroquinone, because it's contained hydroquinone in it as well, is that you don't use it every day. You use it every other day because it's going to exfoliate your skin. So anyway, a lot of you may be willing to give this lotion a try. Some of you may not because you know you you you're afraid to use it. And I understand, but what you need to take note about is the fact that a lot of dermatologists prescribe uh, products with you know steroids in it, but they tell you you know don't use it for longer than two weeks. Don't use it for longer than you know for a month. So anyway, for those of you who are subscribed to my page, thank you so much for being subscribed. For those of you who are not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. Also like and share my videos. Um, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and go ahead and leave a comment underneath the comment section of my video i hope you all are having a great day and i know some of you are really excited some of you who love technology and phones the galaxy s8 the pre-orders start tomorrow i would definitely be pre-ordering my phone i can't wait i'm so excited just to let you know i record my videos with my galaxy um phone and you cannot notice the difference i mean when it comes to the the, the um galaxy phones it has the best damn camera on a phone like the best camera period that is on par meaning it is just basically 100 percent like a, prof a professional dslr um dslr i always have like issues pronouncing it dslr which is professional cameras that most of us youtubers use so you know um, it's just, it does the same. So, um, instead of using, you know, like, uh, my DSLR, my professional camera, I'd rather use my phone sometimes. So, anyway, I hope you all are having a great day and take care.